that a bunch of people ask me about mills, grand, what do you do, how much, blah, blah, blah. You can spend a whole shitload of money on a good mill. Uh, and most of them are worth it. Um, I bought this piece of crap, $22, whatever the hell it was, Walmart uh, hand mill. Because uh, I didn't have my other one ready yet. I was going to design a new one. So all I do is grain bag, slice it, put it over the top here just to control the flow of the crushed grains into the bucket. For the bucket, I put a garbage bag in the bucket. I actually sliced two chunks out of the bucket where I mount my board to that's holding the mill. Can't get any easier than this. Take the handle, remove the handle, ground it down. Uh, a bolt so it fits the drill in there cheap Walmart um, battery operated $30 whatever the hell it was came with a set of batteries one battery will go through 20 pounds of grain so uh, catch it in the bag falls into there and let me show you got a bucket here I just feed this in as it's going and feed it in every two seconds uh, as it's going down. I'll show you what it looks like. Ground. Excuse me, I only got one hand doing this. Here's my uh, here's my grind. There is not any whole seeds left in there. Any whole grains. Everything's done. It's not shredded. To where I have any issues with it, um, but again, it's a very fine. There's no whole grains in there. Everything is broken up. It's a nice flour. Sugars are exposed. I get great efficiency with this. So, uh, what's this whole thing cost? I don't know. Is it thirty dollars or whatever? Forty bucks total uh, for the drill and the mill. And uh, bought it two years ago. I was going to use it for a couple times until I replaced it with a mill. I'm not replacing it. I'll use this thing until it dies. So uh, this is taking a thousand pounds of grain through it already. It works like a champ. But there you have it. You want a cheap way to mill at the house? This is it.